Hello everybody! What's new in the whole universe? I hope that everything is fine and I'm a Russian man who brings value through my own experiences and today we're gonna talk about one interesting thing. Brainstorming ideas for my book Arel and Galivar or maybe Barista and the Magic Ferret or maybe about homeless people or maybe about entertainers and we will do brainstorming. I think that it will be a nice process because I like to, I, I really like to brainstorm on a paper or when I do kind of typing on a computer, on a screen and I really like it. And uh, I like to talk about what I create, what I do, what I I kind of accomplish. I like to speak about this. It is kind of my natural DNA, maybe, maybe it is kind of feeling I really like to talk about what have I done. Not like when I was relaxing, like I was going to Miami or different countries, I was laying and I was relaxing, lazy, fat person and uh, Jesus Christ, I ate a lot of food. Yes, maybe we can talk this, uh, <laughs> this only for jokes, but I like to speak about what I do and what I created by my mind. It is really something interesting. And I understand that maybe it will be not really super interesting content for big amount of people, at least in Russia. I decided yesterday and uh, today I uploaded my two videos on the Russian channel and uh, I started to speak about my universe that I create, universe of Elvers. Elvers is a god of, uh, of four dark gods. <laughs> four dark gods is uh, like a clan of gods, yes I imagine it is like a specific group of them and they live in a Nerevar. Nerevar is a world of Elvers. Elvers is so someone like a god, yes. Yes, I imagine this. It is everywhere. God is everywhere, and it is Elvers. And I started to upload this, and I started to feel really like maybe good because I understand that I do right now things that I want to do. I do things that if I will die today, then it's okay. I mean that not like if I will die and uh, yes, it will be not really a nice thing maybe for my parents and some people, yes, who care about me, yes, I understand, but it will be kind of, I was doing what I want, I do what I want, not like what society says to me to do. And sometimes I have kind of feelings about this, uh, I mean, that I need to do content that brings me money money brings me a lot of dollars or maybe not a lot but for rent and for food right now i have money and i have them for kind of two months or maybe one two months i mean that it is like storage of money that i have and if i can right now switch my kind of uh, audience to the way how I speak about my things, it will be better. Like when I speak about my things and uh, it is the same like to do photos of your ass when it is uh, or your back and uh, your buttocks uh, when you are a photo model uh, or do maybe something about uh, hygiene. You, you like to speak about hygiene, but you do photos of your ass because uh, you, it gets more likes and it's the same. And I understand what uh, right now is popular in Russian in Russian language negative triggered content negative triggered content means that something really speaking about negative news and things of uh, this because Russian mentality maybe other countries too but in Russia it is uh, more I, I think so because in other countries you have it a lot like and this content and this and this 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 you have more tolerance in your countries at least uh, us, as we know, yes, it is more tolerance than in Russia, maybe in South Korea also y they have not super big amount of tolerance, but if uh, we compare countries, in United States you have a lot of co tolerance in United Kingdom and it means that you have more kind of opportunity to upload content and uh, it is everywhere and in Russia it is no tolerance and what we all do, we kind of complain about things, it is about mentality, it's okay. It's okay guys, nothing nothing wrong about it, it is kind of, if they feel good when they complain, okay, 
Really, if they feel happy when, oh, Jesus Christ, what the hell is going on in our country? If they feel this kind of, they are comedians and funny dudes, as I am, I can do a kind of, I can speak about funny thing in a funny manner. But sometimes people will really like, Jesus Christ, they are crying. If you cry, then do, that's all, it's all the answer. And... Uh, Yes, no need to cry, guys. Uh, save your tears. But sometimes tear, tearing and crying is a good thing. I like crying, by the way. It is a good emotion. I like this. So, and I thought, thought, thought and decided that need to create content that will be about what I do. Because in English, I accomplished kind of level. Right now I have... Uh, why did I create this channel? I wanted to show my journey of a Russian man who learns English through my own experiences. Then I started to do learning drums and things of this nature. Good! I learned it and uh, a nice level, by the way. And playing piano, good level too. I continue practicing, not uh, like in a way I learn things, I compose things right now. Kind of create uh, new music, new songs, not every day, but I mostly write, m write things. And uh, write poetry, write uh, stories and this uh, nature. And uh, now I want to focus speaking on this channel and in Russian about speaking about my universes, maybe, worlds, because I think that someone maybe will be interested in it. And maybe my progress, how I do this. Maybe yes, maybe you will. So, let's start our talk. Maybe I will do mistakes, it will be brainstorming. Let's start a story. It will be a story maybe about... <laughs> about whom? We have different choices. Gnome, gnome like small creature. Elf, maybe it will be dwarf, maybe a book. Maybe it will be like a bottle of water. Let's uh, let's uh, let's start from a bottle of water. We have a bottle of water. Yes, it is uh, here our creature, and bottle can can walk in this world. And I think that it will be interesting when the bottle of water will be in a world of fire. How it, how will it work? Hmm? Guys, like, I imagine, not like a w bottle of water in real world, but in a world of fi fire, it is kind of logic, it is kind of need to think about how uh, it will work. Maybe it will be a kind of fireproofed bottle of water, and that is world of bottle proofed bottles of water. I mean that uh, fireproofed bottles of water, and they are kind of jumping <laughs> on this fire, and uh, they do things. Okay. It is first type of story that we can create. Also, we can create a story about maybe the huge panda. Panda, but it is okay. We know the the story about panda. Panda, it is kung fu panda. Yes, you remember it is Disney. Maybe it will be the mathematician. Mathematician, but who? Rabbit. Rabbit mathematician, who was counting, who was counting doings of other people who was counting doings of uh, different animals. Maybe it will be Kakadu. Uh, he was counting like how many Kakadu is uh, kind of uh, flying creature, yes? And uh, with... Uh, wh what's the name of it? What's the name? Crow? No, Crow is the name. I mean that uh, this... this tool nose. Nose of... Um, I need to Google. One moment. Nose of a bird. What's the name? Bird nose, bird nose, uh, do mammals do, birds nostrils, nostrils does contain, what's name, beak, 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 beak of kakadu, kakadu, one moment, we will go kakadu, who is it, kakadu, ah, in, in your it is kakad, kakad, kakadu, yes, really, the name, kakadu, C O C K A T U O O. Wow, interesting looking. Yes, Coca Two. We have, uh, and he was counting how many <laughs> ferrets, like small particles of his. I don't know this vocabulary, by the way. Need to describe these things. 
how he was counting how many ferrets he was having and how many wing wing moving move <laughs> movements he he was doing and in one day happened this rabbit uh, y y you remember and in one day happened uh, he forgot how to count and uh, all the all the animals who were known about his ability he started to ask can you do this can you do that and uh, it started to appear like i don't remember I don't remember. It is about amnesia, maybe amnesia of a rabbit who was a mathematician, and uh, then the uh, story continued. Uh, this uh, rabbit started to say, "I don't remember the information. What what do you speak about?" And then he started to forget all the information, and uh, they started. Uh, t right now, we need to have a have a motivation, like motivation why they ask these animals. Because uh, they need this, uh, maybe, because uh, they need to go somewhere. And if they don't know numbers, they cannot pass the road, maybe, cannot pass the the place. And uh, they ask this uh, rabbit, can you name, <laughs> can you name a number? Jesus Christ, I'm not really nice at, at uh, improvis improvised storytelling. I mean that improvised storytelling in English, because I don't know n words, need to learn them. But it is a good kind of, I don't know, mot motivation to learn more words. Okay, one more story, I, I was talking about it in Russian language, it is about the books who became vampires. I imagine we have two clans of clans, need to translate it, how to say it correct. Two clans of books. One moment. Need, in Russian it is clan. And in English it will be two clans. One moment translating it is uh, clan. clan, tribe, kindred, fratry, fratry, fratry. Okay, clan. We have two clans of books. Vampires and normal books. And they have different colors. Vampires, they have red colors. And w this normal books, they have white color. And we have one like antagonist of this story, who is a vampire leader, leader of books, Vampy Book. Vampy Book. Vampy Book is a leader of a clan of uh, <laughs> books of vampires. Vampy Book he is uh, biting normal books and they become vampires books are not like they are they are a little bit of scared to become vampires but uh, it's okay when they become vampires vampire books they don't do bad things to books books are the same like uh, they live okay vampires not vampires but people who see vampire books at night at night this vampire books can be alive and they can start to do really scary things to people they can maybe hang them they can eat them they can fly around they can like grab things they can be like they can do pistols and by the way it is artwork for terms of use of YouTube. I don't want to propagand it. It is artwork for educational and scientific purposes. All the moral of things, final moral, bring love and love people. Don't kill, okay? Bring love and uh, hug each other and love. Okay, back to the story. And it was disclaimer. And uh, these flying creatures, they're it people sometimes at night they are hanging them on some maybe uh, trees they go to the cemetery they do kind of vampire things and people started to see at at the city that something happening on news on newspapers sometimes it is writings 
like Jesus Christ, they are killing each other. Like uh, some people were hanged, found hanged. Some people were with the blood poured on the floor. Some people are kind of uh, really Jesus Christ what's happening. Maybe it is suicidal things, some guesses, some the conspiracy theories appeared in this situation. And uh, then what happened? Then uh, people started to understand that it is happening with books and how to kill the books, how to, how to protect it. It is all about connecting with the right books. Jesus Christ, I said the, the my, my plan for the sequel. Okay, <laughs> the, the, the main how to kill vampire books need to burn them with fire. They took fire and they burned them. Jesus Christ, it's like 45, 5, 4, 5, 1, 4 Fahrenheit. <laughs> I think so. And uh, they started to fire books this way and uh, they started to burn them with with the fire and uh, vampire books are dying but the main leader vampy book the leader could be killed only with three white books three white books should be placed here 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 and make a triangle every peak of triangle should be here and also then we can use the fire to burn it. And it is the main secret formula how to kill the vampire book. Only by this. And then need to do some maybe secret formula how to do this. Need to pour some maybe, what's the name of it? Parashok uh, in Russian language. Powder. 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 Flour. Trituration. Farina. Farina need to pour and then heal it and make it kind of I don't know what's the name of it uh, Isgnanie in Russian language uh, I mean exorcism exile banishment, exclusion, ejection expelling, eviction relegation, deportation proscription, extrusion excommunication exilent exorcism I think so exorcism, one moment Exorcism, yes, is uh, exorcism. Exorcism. Need to do exorcism, and then it will be the good book, white book. And while the leader of a book of vampires is alive, then every book w can a possibility they they will become the white uh, the red books. I mean that this the leader of them. He is uh, one leader and who will not be killed by only fire. It is his ability. Immunity. Immune of it. And uh, it is a story that I created right now. I was thinking about the story previously. But now we created a kind of good story. And all what we can create inside of this book, it is about uh, like how it goes. And uh, we, can, uh, we can kind of open... I mean... Jesus, I forgot what's, what I wanted to say. Uh, this book is interesting, I think, th that will be. I created it by my own, need to write it, and uh, maybe it will take 80 pages. Sometimes we can say the story, like, easily. From start to, to the end, with easy. Like, it was this, then happened this, and finally it is the end. Not without, without a description of things, okay? And maybe it uh, should be a children book. Maybe, maybe. Maybe not. Maybe yes. Maybe yes. Yes, yes. And also, what uh, should I say about more? Maybe need to create a book about light bulb. Light bulb. Who is hanging? Hanging there. Or maybe about flags. We have flags, like, and they are walking, leaving flags, and they are how they communicate to each other, what languages they use. If you are interested in this type of brainstorming, let me know. It will be good to know, because I brought to you, like, a lot of value, I think so, in a mini of speaking. I don't like to edit videos, yes. Maybe some people... I, I don't prefer. I, I like it, but I don't prefer, because I have technical issues. Okay, excuses.
exclusive thing, exclusive thing, something sluggy. I, I prefer doing like storytelling. It is what I have like advantages. My current level of it is super nice. I am super brainstorming idea and uh, really nice uh, storyteller, uh, storyteller, I think so. And I want to focus on it. And I don't do kind of uh, editing. I think that uh, in two years, maybe less, I will have an editor who will do kind of a better work and then this content will be kind of growing. Why is my channel not growing maybe now? Because I don't speak about viral topics, viral titles, but I know how to create them and I don't want to sell it kind of. I don't want to sell. I want to kind of share it. And if you have an opportunity to kind of help me with uh, your support, material I will be thankful really it's not like I want your money it is kind of I imagine that it is a charge and uh, I have a kind of not a need super need but uh, it will be really thankful I will be really thankful if you will support this channel with these things it is not again the thing that Jesus Christ buy my courses I don't want to sell you courses I want to kind of continue creating, that's all. If you can help me, okay, if not, then two months and then maybe I will I will change the content to something maybe stupidish and uh, maybe so with another type or maybe I will go to work or maybe something else freelancing, yes? So, thank you a lot for watching, see you next time, improve still daily, go forward and know that everything in your life depends on you. Uh, the same as for me and for you. <laughs> see ya, be cool, improve still daily.